since the pandemic, there's been a huge surge in the number of ghost guns that have been seized at crime scenes, so much so that today city leaders confronted that problem head on. There's no question that ghost guns are an epidemic nationwide, but today our council voted on our obligation to protect the lives of Angelinos. The use of ghost guns in crimes is growing at an alarming rate. With today's move, it will become illegal to buy, sell, possess, or transport the weapon in the city of Los Angeles. A ban met with emotion by the chief of the Los Angeles Police Department, Michael Moore. We have individuals across the city and in this region that literally are manufacturing and selling guns by the dozen. Firearms such as rifles, AR-15s, which is nothing more than a killing machine. Basically, a ghost gun is a weapon like this that cannot be traced. Sometimes the serial number is rubbed off, or the gun is made from a kit bought legally, or sometimes for as little as $350. But not anymore in the city of L.A. Crime victims My like this Alex young man Foster. praise the council's decision. His brother was murdered by a ghost uh, gun carrying assailant, and he was struck too. The rise of ghost guns uh, is a real threat and deadly threat to our communities. Once the mayor signs the bill, anyone caught with a ghost gun faces up to six months in jail and a thousand dollar fine. And we're finding them at the ha at the at crime scenes and on persons that were arresting for murder, for robbery, for aggravated assault. Those are some pretty sobering numbers that we heard today. The chief went on to say that, of course, this won't solve the problem, but he thought it was an important first step. Laura Diaz reporting live from Hollywood. Now back to the studio. Serious issue indeed, Laura. Thank you.